Hey guys, it's Matt, and welcome to Speed Tutor. And you know, I like to keep everybody up to date with the best Unity bundles and stuff that appears. Now, this one that's just hit the Unity Asset Store is 11 assets for $1. Yeah, I know I've featured some before, which have been about, you know, so many assets for $1 each. No, this is 11 whole assets for $1. So if you put all the assets together, it'll be around $300 in value. You may well have some of these assets. But I think for $1, you can just grab the rest if you like hoarding assets like I do. So I'll run through all these assets. I'll put all the links down below to each individual asset if you want to check them out and a link to the bundle so you don't miss out on anything. Do be sure to put a like on this video and subscribe because it helps me out massively. So thank you so much. I'll just mention to everybody as well, it's the 16th Unity Award sale that's on at the moment and you can get 50% off a lot of the popular terrain and really high rated assets if you want some big discounts there. First one is the 2D Pixel Unit Maker, which as it suggests, you can make your own pixel characters in a really nice and easy style editor. So you could drag and drop this in. It's got a unit editor, a sprite editor, and a sample project with hundreds of different eyes, bodies, hair, facial hair, clothes, pants, helmets, armor, weapons, and everything you can make with this. It even includes 20 different animation clips and various things to include all parts. We've got the procedural walk animation, which is a tool to create walk animations for different characters. This is suitable across all pipelines, and this can allow you to do walking, running, and other style animations in a procedural way. So even the body when it goes up slopes and other gradients on terrains, the body will adjust automatically and rotate to make this look more realistic, especially when you get creatures with more legs and things that require more of a realistic look. Got something called Smart Lighting 2D, which is a very popular asset and it's a powerful solution for 2D, which allows you to create multiple light maps and personalized light logic to make this look more realistic. So this is actually suitable for spotlights, point lights, directional lights, and different light particles. Has support for HDR, shader graph, tile map, and normal maps with a day to night cycle, loads of material systems, and over 20 demo scenes to try this out. We've got the MFPS 2.0 multiplayer FPS, and this does include three game modes, a team deathmatch, free for all, and capture the flag and then five more add-ons de with demolition, elimination, cover point, kill confirmed, and gun race. It has got loads of integrated features, whether that's voice chat, private and public matches, anti-cheats, it's got grenade launches, loads of weaponry, and things with advanced movement, weapon animations, it's got full servers, lobbies, IK support, falling explosions, pickups, headshot detection, multiple footsteps for surfaces, teammate names, and so, 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 so many more. We've got the scene switcher, which if you need a prototype that works out of the box, you just import this in and you can cycle through scenes really easily with a simple UI, as easy as that. Next one in this list is something called Flare Engine, which is something for 2D tools. And this does come with its own player controller, which has things for jumping, air sliding, gliding, hovering, walking, running slopes, rotations, and, and every different style movement. It's got a full sprite engine. It's got interactables, so you can swing on ropes, you can swim, and you can do lots of different things like that. It's got interactive foliage, full AI systems, including behavior trees, state machines, and even pathfinding. It's got its full imagery system where you can find and store items, a full dialogue system to chat with NPCs, create conversations and messages, and it even comes with a tweening library so you can make different animations and things move between them. I've used this a few times and it's called the FPS Framework and it's an advanced FPS system exactly out of the box and it's really slick. It's got a modular character controller. It's also got FPS controller support. You can replace the system with your own. It's got a flexible inventory. It's got a firearm system, explosions, projectiles, or respawn systems, custom spray patterns, a modular attachment system, procedural animations, new input, gamepad support, and even a menu with loads of info, hit markers, and everything that you'll need to get your UI and FPS game started. We've got the Toonie Tiny RTS set, which is a bit of a tongue twister, and this has a bunch of mobile friendly assets, including loads of character models with 50 bodies, 70 heads, horse models, 20 buildings and towers, over 75 different weapons, and 130 customizable animations. We've got the Cartoon GUI pack, which is a mobile friendly and customizable pack in a very particular cartoon style with 210 colored icons, 120 white icons, and 12 avatar icons 
all with different portrait levels, PSDs. We've got the low poly cartoon house interiors, which is over 400 prefabs in a low poly modular style with kitchen props, room items, curtains, flowers, decorative items, walls, floors, and everything you need to decorate your own home in this low poly style. Next one, we've got the RPG farming kit, which is a template to create your own farming game with character customization, a save system, time system, inventories, item actions, grid selections, full combat. It's got planting and growing crops. You've got your own crate inventory, enemies that you can battle, a weather system, and it's got other major upgrades too. So it's quite a wide selection of assets in this bundle, and I'll show you how to redeem this too. So you navigate to the quick start bundle, you can find the link down below. You can enter $1 or you can enter a custom amount, whatever's suitable for you. And when you've done that, you can click get the bundle now. And then when you're on this page, make sure that you tick, you understand the end user license and make sure you've input all the details and click pay now. And then when you've got this, you can navigate to the top corner and make sure you go to my assets. And sometimes the asset store has been updated and sometimes you get the new UI and sometimes you get the old. So you just make sure you navigate to your assets and you'll see all of the assets that have been added below. So I do hope you find this useful. I'll put all the links down below so you don't miss out. Be sure to check out my Patreon too to get over 225 different scripts, assets and projects you cannot find anywhere else. Massive thank you to all my patrons, special thank you to Peter Steiner, Vera Shooter, Jennifer and David for their amazing support and thank you to everybody else who comes to watch the video so don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Cheers.